Now, I'm not mad at her because she made this baby with some love. She talking about I can't pray. I'm laughing at her tail talking about somebody said it grace while she was lighting the poor child. Good morning, good morning, good morning. This is the day the Lord has made. We must rejoice and be glad in it. Welcome to the Conscious segment of this amazing event. Hello to my sister. Hey, vlog. We're hanging out again. So it is time for me to make the macaroni and tuna salad. Y'all, my friend, my friend is so OCD. Oh. She ready. What are you saying? Not the time or the place, baby, it's not right. It's not right, no. Going insane. Got a problem to fix, can we face tonight? Face tonight. Oh, no. Good morning, good people. Good morning, good morning, good morning. This is the day the Lord has made. We must rejoice and be glad in it. And and let me open this vlog. Hey, hey, what's up? What's up, world? It's me, your girl, Angela. How are you doing? Welcome to Doing Life with Angela, where we talk about all things style, all things fashion, all things fabulous. Mostly, we talk about life. Uh, if you watched my last video that I put up about my um, Dollar Tree beauty secrets and beauties, things that you can find from Dollar Store, you will see that I told you guys about this product right here. It's by Be Pure, and it is a dupe for Neutrogena. And some people think it's oil of belay too, but I really looked it up and they said Neutrogena. Uh, I used this night cream last night and i used the moisture the um cleanser this morning the cleanser has like a foliation in it as well uh which is really really um good it felt it felt good and uh, my face is so smooth i don't have the moisturizer because when i purchased these two products i purchased two night creams so i have to go and get the moisturizer but instead this one i'm just going to use my rosemary oil well, it's not rosemary, I'm sorry, my rose oil on my face. And then I'm going to put some sunscreen on. And then I'm going to go to the Dollar Tree. Well, I'm going to get the moisturizer first. Then I put my sunscreen on. I hate to go outside without my sunscreen. But I want to use the whole line to make sure that I'm giving you guys the true and the real results. Keep in mind, everything don't work for everybody. I am just sharing with you something that I feel like you can uh, maybe you cannot benefit from. And this is me using the deodorant that I told you guys about. And while I am over there, I will see what other secrets or great finds we can get over there at the Dollar Tree. Dollar Tree. Dollar Tree. It's a no makeup day for me. No makeup day for me. Clean my glasses. Take my sister to drop her car off to the mechanic. And then we're going to have breakfast somewhere and bring you guys with us. Lego. Thank <laughs> you. 
Okay, I'm going to talk a little loud because we're here in front of the fans. Um, we're at um, Tasty G. This is my very first time being here. I've seen it all on uh, YouTube. I've seen it on Instagram. Uh, but this is our first time trying. Uh, unfortunately, um, I'm going to give them a five so far because they don't have um, flour. Because they don't have flour, they can't do pork chop. They can't do fried pork chop. They can't do fried chicken wings. Um, but um, let me taste what they can do and I'm going to tell you um, should you or should you not make this trip okay it is literally inside of a warehouse um, Haitian owned uh, African American slash Haitian something like that but nevertheless we're going to give them a try and I'm not going to bust them all the way in the head because try not to hurt black business but let's give them a try let's pray the food tastes better to um, eliminate uh, the disappointment that I'm already experiencing. Um, plus, 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 customer service is amazing. We have a server named Ashley, and she's doing an amazing job of trying to um, console me and let us know that and accommodate, um, and accommodate us. Well. Yeah, that part. This is lemonade and tea, which is on a farmer, but they call it the flop. They call it the flop. I'm gonna leave it there. I'm an auto farmer kind of tour, so I'm gonna let you see. You want me to put a lemon in that too? Yes, please. You know what? You about to get this in. Ashley, where the squirrels at, baby? I'm gonna get it for you right now. That's actually a little too sweet for me. I don't like that. They got that good eyes, though. They got that good eyes. I don't like a lot of sweet stuff. It's a little too sweet for me. You gotta talk loud. Why don't you get that sweet stuff? Yeah, you gotta get it I had to take a station identification break of what I just saw. But yeah, it's a little too sweet for me, but I like it. This mine, this, this, this me right here, because I love more lemon than tea. So it's dead on the money for yeah, me right here. Thank you, Thank you Ashley. Y'all, if y'all come to the Tasty, Tasty G spot, ask for Ashley to, Ashley to be y'all way to say, Ashley is doing an amazing job. Thank you. Oh, this is Remember, I got the duo with the. With yeah, the where the chicken bag? Girl, you can just grab the shrimp on the side. No, oh, all right. Oh, oh, Okay, good people. We just tried Tasty G's spot. You know, it's three of us. Uh, everybody have an opinion. They had already lost me when I got there. And I hate when you come to serve, come to a restaurant and they don't have things. Um, I get, um, you forget, I forget um, that uh, you run out of things, but this is a small, uh, I wanna say mom and pop, although I don't know if it's a husband and wife, mother and, and, and father, but what I'm saying is a small business where you could send a worker this is my opinion a worker or someone to get those things that you're missing especially when it's something as simple as flour uh i did say that ashley the, our, our server was amazing. amazing she had a great personality and she know the lord honey she yeah, know the lord spirit. Great spirit. and she kept speaking um life over mary which was amazing uh i had the catfish and grits what I didn't like about that is I don't like my catfish on top of my grits. Uh, other than that, um, out of a score of 10, I'm probably going to give it a 7 out of 10. Um, the flavor was good, but that's all they're going to get from me, about a 7 out of 10. Uh, keep in mind, if you like ice, they have um, the small ice um, cube makers. So, you know, I love that good ice. Um, what you got to say, Mary? The food was excellent um, to me. Excellent? That's yeah. a lot. 
yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. The food was good. It yeah. was flavored to me. Um, and the fact, yes, they didn't have flour, but I asked them, could they grill my pork chop? And they grill my um, pork chop. Good. They good. They they was they was trying. Ashley was trying with yeah, everything. Yeah, Ashley was trying. She um, really in her. So um, that I won't say don't come back to them. I won't say don't come. Yeah. I won't say give them a try. Keep yeah. in mind that it is a small business, and you have to be patient with them because they're well known. Oh, yeah, Brian, yeah. what you got to say? And he leaned forward to the clip. Oh, and um, I think one of the reasons why it does take patience is because everything, you know, those main courses, the meat, the meats are cooked to order, right? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So you got to wait for that. Nothing is, you know, there pretty much. Um, they do have almost looks like like a little smorgasbord of some things mm -hmm. that are there that I noticed for like takeouts, whatever. Mm -hmm. But like the things that we had, you know, you can tell that it was cooked to our order because it was hot. I enjoyed um, my food a lot. We had this on a Palmer, but they called it the flop. A little bit too sweet for me. Perfect for me. But um, and everybody has a different opinion. Right. Like, everybody have a different right. taste. Better go to eggs. Oh, see now see, they, they got eggs. Now they bring eggs, and yeah. they probably got flour too coming. Yeah, they have flour, the flour already. Yeah. Flour already oh, came. the flour already but came. You, but that you know that go hand in hand with a small business. Um, open up the kitchen. There's. The, well, I, I was selling food at my house, and my mama was nice though. And so a lot of time when we ran out. We could run to my mom's house. Mm -hmm. And so when you when you have a uh, small business like this, granted, they're in a warehouse. So the storage space may be limited. Um, I didn't see directly where they was cooking from. I was trying to peep and see on the side that they had a door. They that they, right there. There's a door right there. So they just probably just got the front of this place. Yeah, because the other front part, they're using it as a sitting area. But all in all, I'll, I'll give them another try. I, let me just say that. I will give them another try. I want to. I'll give them an eight and um, eight they point five. Did they drop something? Oh no. God! Mm -hmm. I'll give yes, them an did. eight point that five wait. out of ten. That's my score. Eight point five out of ten. And I will come back. I want to come back to give another opportunity as far as the like Angela was saying the the uh, fried um, the chicken or whatever the case may be. You know, I would try that again because I like the and the food was good. And like we said, Ashley, an amazing um, server beautiful spirit great personality i think she was the one that kept us going because i declare uh had ashley been nasty my sister don't take the people chicken is he taking a tour oh yeah that's yeah. it fell out had ashley been nasty um my, been, oh yeah, yeah, yeah my yeah. sister would have got up and left yeah, us yeah yeah yeah, 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 <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So Ashley, so that girl at one point she had gave that girl one of the Merle loops. If you know listen, listen, that's yeah. my mom. Yeah, listen. Ashley saved the day. I, I don't play. I love to go try new mm -hmm. places. I love to give people a, 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 a try. But um, you know things are expensive, so you don't want nobody to be giving you no run around or, or no playing with your money or playing with your food. But like I said, um, it's some things that we as women, I don't want to say women of color, it's some things that we All as, people. Uh, we, but mostly we as black people, I get it because things are high for us. We're a small business, so we pay more, right? When you, big companies, they get stuff for cheaper. So you have to pay more. But what I'm going to say is that we have to do better. Sometimes we feel like um, it is okay for us to handle each other any kind of way. I don't like that. And let it be known because of the fact that they are a small business and, and every, uh, the economy has a whole lot to do with how people have just, it's upcharging on so much yeah. stuff. Do not come here and expect to, pray, to pay um, $12. $12 for that's not the case. breakfast. Right. And this is what I'm saying. Breakfast is $22, $25, $30. $30. So that's it. when I'm paying that price, then I expect for that type of service. And so Ashley was amazing. I, I do. I give her 10 out of 10. I give my server 10 out of 10 her pleasant, her personality, her ability to keep you uplifted. I give her in her honesty. She was so honest yeah, about everything. Was. So she I was. give her a 10 out of 10 of that. Uh, the food. The presentation. The food was served The well. presentation was good. good. The, yeah. presenta the was presentation good. was good. good. The presentation good. was good. really good. What I did. And it was hot. That's the part yeah. I like. Because a lot of times you go to a small place and they mm -hmm. be busy. You come out with cold, cold food. food. Yeah, you well, just, that, you that just, you just, you just messed me up like that, though. I'm just saying. You just can't come out of the gate. Yeah. Um, you close at 3. I get it. We're getting there like 11. You out of everything already. 
No. It, it, no. It wasn't they had they had they had the flour so they couldn't cook it. Yeah, they couldn't cook it. Um, somebody didn't, didn't do right when it came down to shopping. And somebody uh, could have read the story. Yeah, that's immature. That's what it was. You could have run them with Dixie and Absolutely. get some flour. Absolutely. You yeah. could have ran the Publix and bought three, yeah. four bags of flour. Yeah. Right? Yeah. They yeah. could have They could have been well, like... Well, I picked the bag. They went to Bravo's and picked it up. You know, you know, I know Bravo's. I know the bag. You know, you you can ask me yeah. about these these small grocery yeah. stores, and I can tell you, you know, like when you know, you know. Yeah. But all in all, I will give them another try. I will. I would too. I will. All right, y'all. They say they'll give them another try. I'm gonna think about it. Uh, I, I I would probably try um, the French toast. I did want to try the French toast, but I didn't want to try the French toast without the. Um, fried chicken and you said stuff. it looked pretty right yeah it was pretty it was pretty according to what she showed me but um yeah <sighs> tasty g's spot try them tasty g spot uh-huh and i think they named their alma palmer the right name flop, flop. <laughs> i'll let you hey hey good people it is wednesday it is Wednesday. I didn't do anything yesterday. I slept. Uh, this morning I got up and I uh, ran a few errands and uh, I came back and uh, put on my famous Sephora powder. It is 46 why hope you can see it it may focus it may not 46 why nevertheless the last thing i did was monday when i went to uh lunch with my sisters and we went to tasty g spot uh we all had different sort of kind of different um reviews uh, uh let me let you know i really did not hate the place but i it just started off wrong it started off wrong with me when you order stuff and they're constantly saying we can't do that because we don't have this we don't have this nevertheless and also it is a place it's a restaurant but they're limited on ice you can't even get a full cup of ice so those things already had ticked me off and made me just have a deaf ear to everything else but nevertheless um when i said i don't like my fish on top of my grits it's because they had this sauce the grits was swimming in this sauce and so the fish got wet and i didn't like that anyway nevertheless um give them a try you know we always want to support black businesses and what i'm saying sometimes because they know that we want to support them i'm a black business also sometimes we feel like we could just serve our people anything and they'll be okay with we gotta always get a pass but we can't always give a pass y'all y'all know that i live with my siblings and my mom and so they're always screaming and hollering because they loud talking but nevertheless um this is a house that we live in it's not a content house this is a house that people live in and so anyway i just think that we as we as people they already feel like we can't do anything great and then we do a lot of things great I'm still using these here capsules. I love this. It make your face feel like silk. It's only 10 in here, but um, I'm gonna buy this one again. And I really love the way this make you feel. This 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 feel good. And I know it's the Dollar Tree products, uh, dollar and 25 cent, five quarters. But so far, them five quarters feel like it was well spent, well spent. Uh, today, I am going to uh, get up and I well I already did I ran some errands I am washing I'm also going to cook some barbecue chicken I'm thinking baked beans and some macaroni and tuna salad because you get tired of eating the same thing we only eat those for um, 4th of July and uh, holidays and stuff like that so I think we'll do something different and you know cook that today and I am washing clothes and y'all know when I wash clothes I have to go to the um laundromat to dry my clothes and so i'm gonna do that today but oh let me share this with you guys i love this here um uh, it's by lancome it's your their um makeup remover 
look i don't use the crap out of this i gotta get this again it's called take the day off this really do take the day off and i think this is like 20 dollars, something like that but uh, maybe a little more but anyway i got it from tj maxx for little or nothing so i'm gonna go back to tj maxx and see if i can find some more of this because it really do work this is lancome take the day off this the price has worn off so i can't tell you but anyway um you could give that a try i've been using it for about two months this is my second one and it really does work um y'all i did a thing sorry that's my work phone i did a thing today guys i decided to go ahead and sign up for therapy hold on you guys because this is my money making phone i decided to go ahead on and finally sign up for therapy you know i have been doing a couple of the drive-by session drive-through therapy but this time i decided to find me a therapist and sit one-on-one -on one-on-one -on -one. I was looking for a black therapist. I didn't want one too old, too young. So I found one that was in her mid forties. And so I have committed to three months of therapy. And I realized that I had kind of blocked out a couple months of this trauma that I experienced. I'm thinking that it's been six months, but it's actually been nine months since uh, my husband. Hold on, y'all. Okay, <laughs> y'all, that's my big brother. Uh, yeah, I did a thing. I signed up and I committed to three months of therapy. And like I was saying, I realized that I, I lost a couple months. I'm thinking that we only been going through this storm for six months, but it's actually been nine months. And it's been nine months that my husband has not worked. And um, God kept us. And I'm, I'm, God kept us. And so anyway, there's some things I need to talk about. Because like I said, I know when this first started, I felt like I was losing my mind. I know that I was, I was uh, not here. I mean, mentally, I was not here. I was functioning, but I was not here. I was not... Um, I was not here. I can't, I don't know what else to say. It's just that I was just existing. I was just going through the motion. And so all of those things take a toll on you. So I'm going to go to therapy. If you guys need therapy, go. It's, it is feasible. And um, like I say, you know, we always find money to do those things we want to do. So. I will carve out a penny or two here and there so I can uh, get me some mental help to move past this storm. So this storm does not affect me for the rest of my days. I am going to get a mic because one of my subscribers said that she's not trying to be rude. And I believe her that she said to get a mic and I listen to it and I need to get a mic. Funny thing, my son has started a YouTube and I can't hear him. He whispered and I guess he get it from me. And I'm like, get a mic, get a mic already. And so I'm going to get a mic, you guys. So thank you, subscriber, for letting me know. I greatly appreciate that. I appreciate you guys when you make a comment or uh, leave a suggestion or, or just uh, a heart or a like. I appreciate you. So thank you for that. So anyway, I'm excited about going to therapy. I'm excited about moving forward. I'm excited about uh, growing old gracefully and not allowing uh, situation and circumstances to really overtake me. Although uh, they was weighing on me, I still, I'm proud of myself and I tell myself, I'm proud of you, Angela, for um, even when you wasn't well, you showed up. Even when uh, you didn't find strength, the, the God in you um, rose up and you was able to show up. And so... I'm going to continue to show up and I am going to continue to seek the better version of me. And listen, 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 Linda, listen. I don't care if you're 60 or 62. If you're still here, I'm sure 
there is something that you want to change or you can change or enhance or do. And so do it. Don't let age stop you. Don't let uh, don't let anything or anyone stop you. So wanted to share that with you. Your girl is going to therapy. Why am I so happy I, to go to therapy? Not that I'm, and I'm not cuckoo for cocoa puff, but you're not cuckoo for cocoa puff. I am so glad that uh, we, as Black people, have grasped that it is okay to go and talk to someone. It is okay to share some things, and it is okay to release those dark, ugly secrets that you was told. Everything that goes in our house stays in our house. This is why we're still doing, dealing with trauma. You know, so anyway, I I have one client this evening. One, I cannot wait till summer is completely over, and I think I'm gonna go and take my hair white. Since I decided to stay bald head and blonde, I'm gonna go white today or tomorrow. But either way, you'll be there. Rooting me on, rooting me on. Go, Angela. Go, Angela. So I'm going to do that. And also, I still have not come up with a name for you guys. I don't know what to call us. What to call us. So help me. Help me. Look, help me help you. You know how I help you. Help me help you. Hi. You know, just just help me. Come up with a name for us. We are a team. We are a community. We are a family. So, uh, yeah. Let me go on in here and cook this chicken. I got to clean it. Take the fat off. Take the feathers off sometimes. I hate when they leave feathers on chicken. So, I got to take care of that. And then I have to run to the store. Oh my God, this is this time it's me going to the store. I'm not taking my mom. I'm going myself. I gotta go and get the stuff to make the baked beans. So be back.
Which one is this? So many of us, we have to do two pans of chicken because we feed my sister next door as well. The noodles are on the macaroni and tuna salad. The chicken is in the oven. Now I am going to do my the noodles are boiling. We're getting ready to um, do the ground beef. We're going to also add some fresh pork sausage in it, and we're going to use Bush baked beans, the brown sugar history baked beans. Just in case you're wondering what are the noodles for, I'm making some macaroni and tuna salad. Yep. And I don't have time. No, I do not have time to chop up onions and bell peppers. So I bought them pre-chopped. Come on, get into it. Get it done, honey. You got to get it done. We put a little bit of brown sugar in the brown beef as it's cooking so it can have flavor as well. When we put it in the baked beans, honey, when we put it in the baked beans, come on, get into it, it, get into it, get into it. Get into it. This does not have beef. These people are funny acting. One of my niece don't eat beef, so the, and she love baked beans, so I had to make a pan for her. And I shouldn't have beef either, so this is for her and I, and this is for everybody. Now it is time for me to make the macaroni and tuna salad. Why am I moving so fast? And I forgot to put the eggs and the noodles so they can boil together. So now I get to clean up while I'm waiting for the eggs to boil.
of good people. Uh, I didn't um, come back after I left the wash house because at around by 6 o'clock, we had to go and clean the Airbnb, and it was horrible. I almost cried three times, and then I quit by five times. It was horrible. I'm talking about disgusting. And I was like, I didn't sign up for this. Nevertheless, I didn't get a chance to um, lighten my hair. Uh, I got in the house probably around 12, in the bed around 1. And so I'm up this morning, have to go to work. Also, I have an event this evening, so I won't get a chance to lighten my hair today because I don't like to go anywhere the day of me um, lighten my hair because it leaves you my face a little, I don't know, discolor, discolor, color, discolored. So I don't want to do that when I have a special event. I am going to a book signing. Uh, one of my friend girls, it's called a 38 Silence Still uh, Unfired Gun Still Kills. It is about childhood trauma, some of the things that she experienced as a child as far as molestation. And so I am also going to be a part of the book signing by interviewing her and a few of her guests. More have a social media talk show called Be True to You. I haven't did it in a couple of months. It's on YouTube as well as Facebook. So today I have to dust off dust off my interview skills and get to work. And um, that is it. We have to wear bright colors because child it's like she doing a full production honey i'm talking about everything is time precise and so i'm gonna do that today so that's it y'all that's what my day is going to be in you will be there with me Unspoken of, but something 
something that was taboo. Now, it is something that's coming to the forefront. And you find a lot of women of color, black people, black men that have realized that therapy is necessary. This book contains some of the hardest stuff I've ever talked about publicly in my life. Hey YouTube, I know y'all haven't seen Janelle in a while, but say hey CG. Hey YouTube. We're still friends, y'all. I know y'all don't thought we ain't friends no more, but we are still friends. This is not just my friend, this is my what? Sister. Yes, this is my sister, y'all. It's my sister. It's my sister. I'm gonna take the dog out. Hello to my sister. Hey vlog. We are hanging out again. We don't have Mary, but it's us two. Just the two of us. We can make it if we try, just to do this. Her and me. Oh. Hi, Mary. Good morning, good people. Good morning, good morning, good morning. It is Friday, and I am going to get me a frozen hot chocolate. The one I got last week was horrible. So hopefully this one is better. And y'all. My friend girl Janelle, she just texts me and say, this morning I'm going to try a frozen hot chocolate. I told her to film myself, so if she do, I'll share that with you. I hope she like it. I've had a couple of people that like it, and I had one person that did not like it, which was my cousin. FYI, I'm talking like this because there is something so strong coming out of this Dunkin' Donuts window if it is stifling me. I'm sure it's the overwhelming burnt coffee that I'm smelling. This is a new um, location, but nevertheless, um, I didn't get a chance still to uh, lighten my hair, but I will. I said no. You said no whipped cream, and she put whipped cream in it. I'm saying you're watching. Them. She making it cute now. But they don't follow orders. Listen to him tell me they don't follow. You too. It says frozen hot chocolate. They don't say anything about no whipped cream. She put whipped cream on it, so it's not her fault. She put whipped cream on it. But anyway, this is the way it should look without the whipped cream. The last time it was white. What they did was, I think they gave me coffee. And uh, anyway, yeah, and it's a small and. I have not been having it every day. Again, this is my second time. It's like once a week now. So let's get into it. Now I'm not mad at her because she made this baby with some love. Let's taste it together. Here, you go first. Don't try to drink it all. Okay, my go. This is way out of my um, direction. But I'm going to have to get him another try. It's been a long time since I had one that tastes this good. All right, you all. So y'all know what it is. This is Angela's good sis, her friend. Um, and... She is always raving about these hot chocolates, okay? These frozen hot chocolate from Dunkin' Donuts. Like, you all pretty much watch her, her, her vlogs, and almost every day, my sis is stopping to Dunkin' Donuts to get her frozen hot chocolate. I decided I'm going to go and get one today. First of all, okay, I like chocolate, but I don't know how much I like chocolate if I'm going to like the frozen hot chocolate. I told them to put a little bit of chocolate. Okay, y'all can see... This is not a little bit of chocolate drizzle, which I told them to put. And so now this is the test of truth. This is the moment of truth. Let's see if this hot choc these frozen chocolates are as good as Angela raves about them to be. All I can taste is chocolate syrup. I'm about to take this back. I don't like this. I'm taking it back. Mm -mm. All I can literally taste is chocolate syrup. That's all I can taste. No bueno. I don't like it. I'm, I'm about to take this back. Mm -mm. So I just got what I knew because I was like, yeah, no. 
frozen coffee, coconut flavored with whipped cream. Eh, maybe it's just this Dunkin' Donuts, but today Dunkin' Donuts ain't work for me. Maybe Angela gonna have to take me to the location that she goes to cause it's just a no bueno for me today, y'all. I am headed to my best friend's house this morning because she's doing a baby shower tomorrow. Um, without me volunteering, without me wanting to, I have been drafted into helping her decorate. So I'm headed to her home to start doing balloons and everything before I head to work. Okay, y'all, I made it to my best friend of over, over 30 years house. Maybe 28 years. I don't know. How long we been friends? How long we been friends? Since we, look, how long we been real friends? Look at this. Who this? This my YouTube channel. <laughs> This is the one who uh, drafted me, y'all. But anyway, I made it. How long we been friends? We just been friends. I'm in sixth time. grade. I met you what sixth grade, right? Right. If we technically count from when we were toddlers, like we don't remember from then. Maybe when um when my cousin stayed next door, I remember Mama Lewis. So, uh, mm -hmm. but we yeah, probably but anyway. didn't connect like that. But however, we were connected in the spirit. Hey, Caleb. Yesterday, happy birthday. How to say it? Birthday yesterday. <laughs> Kayla's birthday was yesterday. He twenty. He twenty. God dog. Anyway, y'all, I'm here to do. Uh, say hi. <laughs> <laughs> that's Caleb. Uh, that's the baby out of four. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. We were supposed. We all had three kids. That she gonna go around and have another one. Um. Don't know what happened. Bumped it. Bumped the head. Just boom. Fell. But it, that's okay. That was a blessing. blessing. Okay. <laughs> that was, I mean, all of them the blessing. But that was blessing. That's what the words say. Mm -hmm. I right. say that's what the words The words say. Yeah. And we're going to have to go with what the words say. Yeah. yeah. Sometimes I wonder. I'll be like, geez, what would you think? But nevertheless, I thank you for mine. Anyway, we're going to mm -hmm. decorate. And we got to go tomorrow. What time are we going tomorrow? <gasps> right after the funeral. Which is? Uh, the funeral is from 11 to 1. I think. Oh, okay. So right after that, I'm going to have stuff packed. Okay. Anyway, so we're going to go and decorate tomorrow. I'm going to go to a drive-by therapy again tomorrow. And then anyway, whatever I do, you know you guys you know. are coming. So, so we're going to see beginning, before, and after? Yeah. That's what they're going to do. So, yeah. Let's go. She knows the do it. It's okay. It's, it'll be music. And then she's going to reflect uh, on that. What you dancing to? Friend, my friend is so O C D oh, to I you. just Oh my God. I can't wear her, okay? Everything has to go in a particular place, okay? Nothing can touch her furniture. Oh my God. Oh, this is gonna be a long night. Man. tell you guys that I'm allergic to everything believe me I am allergic to so much so I'm allergic to latex hold on come on sorry y'all that was my mom checking on me because I was telling you that I'm allergic to latex and although I'm allergic to latex I still do balloon arches for people that I love I try to wear long sleeve or long pants but it does not help it eventually start irritating me and so after I got rid of, got finished helping my best friend, I had to run in here and take a shower. So my mom was just checking on me because she know how bad it is. I can't take a Benadryl because I'm headed to work. But I'll take the Benadryls to work with me. So when I'm about finished, I will take them. 
the irritation of my eyes. I try not to touch my face. I try not to touch my skin. But somehow those balloons touch me, especially when they're huge. Trying to twist them up and tie them together, they end up touching me and it gets through the um, clothing. Nevertheless, I, I just wanted to share that with you guys that I am allergic to so much. Anyway, let's go to work. Good morning, good people. It is Saturday morning. No exercise, no exercise. I am going to another um, drive-by therapy this morning. At the drive-by therapy, I am going to do a client. After that, I am going to go and do the decoration for the baby shower for all the balloons. Um, you guys saw me blowing up yesterday. And uh, speaking of yesterday, uh, my friend girl Janelle did not like the frozen chocolate. Nobody told her to tell them people to add no extra chocolate. Of course all you're going to taste is chocolate. And then she didn't stir it up. But nevertheless, everybody don't like the same thing. But anyway, y'all saw her. She came at my frozen chocolate. I'm not going to suggest it to anybody anymore. Anyway, it's good to me. A few people liked it. A few people didn't. Oh, well. Oh, you know the other word. Anyway, y'all, I am still using this um, Dollar Tree product. This is uh, day five for me. And I am liking it. The only reason why... Uh, it doesn't look like it's doing that great. I take that back. My skin is still having, um, I'm still battling with the hyperpigmentation. I think this is just going to take forever. It's not going to go away quickly. But anyway, this uh, is by B Pure. And I guess the B is for beauty, but it's just B Pure. Pure. B Pure. Right there. And uh, this is the Revivalation, Revivalation um, Cleanser. And this cleanser also has a, a, a gentle exfoliation in it, which smooth skin. So I use this at night and in the morning. I use this hydration night cream. Uh, and I use this moisturizer. And I am still using the capsule. And all this came from the dollar store, you guys. Five whole dollar is what I'm using for my beauty retro regimen at this particular time. These capsules are hard to get into, boy. This neck don't want to come off. You got to make sure when you pop it, you don't lose all your oil. And so, see, this is the serum. And I just rub it in my hand to warm it up, and I just pat it in my face. Sometimes I um, pat the moisturizer in, but at first I'm going to rub the moisturizer in so it can dissolve a little bit. And so that is the serum. How? If you guys have this issue, tell me what are you using? Granted, it was so much darker. Some things just take time. And I told you the ex excess of the oil you can rub in your hair or on your body. Because it's just vitamin C. You can't go wrong with that. After that, I am going to put a little bit of my rose oil. Because I am still using that. And, um... I think about two vlogs back, I told you that I shared the link where I got this from Amazon. And that's all, about two good drops. And I also told you to make sure you use the lighter products before the heavier 
and that is the texture. Oil usually go first before cream. I don't know what I do though. I am tired. I tell you, the older I get, the more problems I have. Oh my God, I have the morning voice. So I know my voice uh, sounds low. I haven't been able to order my mic yet. So if you have a problem to problem hearing me, I'm so sorry. Just turn your volume up just a little bit until I can get <clears throat> my voice to come up to a higher, a higher volume. Um, yeah, this is the um, amount of moisturizer I am using. Maybe like a size of a nickel. And I'm going to start like that. And then I will rub it in some. Go down my neck. My ears. And I'm going to start. Although I am going to a um, dry by, I am not putting on any foundation. The girl tried to stay away from foundation. When we get around a group of women, somebody is always taking pictures, so I want to make sure I ain't looking a mess. This is Mary Kay concealer. I'm just gonna put a little bit right there. This is bronze deep. Come on in, babe. Come on in. He always sticking his head out and run. <laughs> Say good morning. Say good morning to the vlogger. Good morning, vlog. And I'm also going to use some of my uh, Dollar Tree um, uh, shadows. Okay, and this is just going to be patted into. And remember I told you guys to push upward. And every time you want to be lifted, you just go up like over into your cheekbone. If not, you want a round face, you don't take it out that far. And I'm just going to push that in like that, like so, like so, like that. And come down my nose again because this is where I have such dark areas and then I'm going to just get my beauty blotter to fiddle in a little more let me look at my mirror y'all there we have it all blended in I am going to get my Sephora powder powder this stuff if you use it in regular it's not that deep see I already need another one so I will go buy one probably. No, not today, but sometime this week because I don't have enough time. I'm gonna be running from one to the other of the event. I think it's in that over at like 12. I'm gonna have to leave a little earlier so I can go and do um, my client. But the good thing is not too far from each other. I'm going to get my brush to speed this up a little.
not gonna do anything to my eyebrows. I'm not trying to look all made up, just look a little. A little life. A little life to myself. A little life to myself. What are you guys doing today? My friend girl, 38 silencer, on fire guns, still kill uh, book signing. It was really good. It was emotional. It caused um, some people to deal with things they have been burying, not focusing. It caused them to look into some things. It caused some disturbance in their spirit, but it it is good, right? Because the whole thing is to make you want to be free so you can set others free as well as yourself. Also, I like to always try to give y'all a tip Whenever you are putting on a eyeliner, these fingers are the strongest fingers. So you never want to pull down your skin to uh, put on any eyeliner or mascara. With these two fingers, you want to use this finger here or the pinky. But I normally use this one every now and then. I would use the pinky, but you don't want to use these two. You don't want to use these two fingers. You want to use this finger or the pinky. The pinky. What is this finger called? The one next to the pinky. What is that called? What is that? What is that, Linda? What is that called? So, and then I am just going to brush on a little bit of my um, Dollar Tree shadows. And I didn't even use a, um, a, um, primer this morning because I'm just doing a little bit of color just a little bit so no primer this morning my brush system that I use is hard to find the brushes that I'm looking for and then I'm going to use the darkest one just down to the bottom and it's showing up for it to be the dollar store honey without a problem See that? And look at my mirror. And then I'm going to use a little bit of this right above, like right in my crease. Right here. And I don't want much because, again, it is Saturday morning, so I ain't trying to be extremely glam. Just look like we are lurk. We are a lurk. We are a lurk. Okay, that's all we want. That is all we want. And we just blend, 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 and if I can find them, y'all know I'm working with a little bit of space. So sometimes I put stuff down and can't find it. I wanted to use, I was going to use my Dollar Tree um, blush, but honestly, I don't feel like digging everything out to find it. So we're just going to go with... Um, 
this book um f f they laugh at the way i say f this just a little blush for f and i don't know if you guys are gonna be able to see the name of it and i i will put on my glasses to try to tell you it is called just matte blush oh always rosy you can see it right here always rosy this is a matte blush and we're just going to add her and call it a day always rosy see we of people of color can have rosy cheeks too I am going to put on my liner to use another one of my L um, lip lip oil this is in the blog and I talked about all the lipsticks so I can find it in there and that is my beauty for today now let me get dressed Put on me some earrings. I think I'm gonna use them. I'm gonna wear my new favor from my client Sharon, which are my LV. God, when a client knows you and believes in you and support you and purchase gifts for you. I oh, just love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. Thanks, Sharon. Thanks, Sharon. Thanks, Sharon. I know there is one um, YouTuber on here. I forgot her name. I'm going to find her name. She was like, no disrespect. I said this already. But get a mic. And I appreciate that. I appreciate that. I appreciate her giving me uh, feedback. I'm working on it. I'm working on it. I am working on it. There we have it. Oh. I'm so bald here. Sometimes I forgot. To, I forget to put oil in my hair. So let me do that. This is the oil that I created myself. Yep. It was a brush cut, but you can see it is growing. Grow, hair, grow, grow, hair, grow. I talked to it. Grow, hair, grow, grow, hair, grow. I'm not going to brush it because I don't want it to try to lay down. I'm going to go lay down, go lay down. It don't take much when you don't have that much hair that is. I ain't got that much hair. This here is a wrap straighten sheen, but I like to use it on my hair as well because it um gives me a shine and make my curls pop a little. My lack of curls pop a little bit. A little. See that? And that is it, y'all. Don't take much for me to get together on a normal day. And on a normal day, I'm doing too much. I just put my pot on and some eyeliner, a little mascara, and my lips. Okay, lip liner and um, a gloss or a uh, lipstick for today is just going to be a gloss. I'm going to wear my jean skirt that I got from Target and uh, I think a white shirt. I don't know, but anyway, I'll let you see it when I get it together. I am carrying this. Y'all, let me tell y'all something about me. 
I love fashion, but I know no names of the items I have. This comes with the three um, three sizes, small, medium, and large, I guess. So I am carrying this as uh, my makeup kit because I am carrying this handbag today. Hold on. But yeah, I'm carrying this handbag today with that. Yeah, let's get dressed. What am I wearing? First, what fragrance am I going to wear? I'm probably going to wear my Tom Ford. Uh, I'm going to wear my Tom Ford today. Fiddle Peach today is what I'm going to wear once I get dressed. So let's get dressed. Let go. Let go and get dressed. So y'all, I don't have any of that De Janeiro or whatever. So I'm using my Dollar Tree. Uh, gummy bear moisture on um, body butter creamy rich smells so good I'm putting this on my arms and this shirt I have on is from Target it is New Day it's a crop top this I think I got it in a medium and it is still too big I should have got a small and I didn't iron it, but it'll be okay. And my jean skirt that I was telling you guys about, it is by Universal Threads. Yep. Universal Threads is the skirt, and the shirt is New Day. New Day, New Day, New Day, New Day. I tried to adjust it because the sun has a glare. It's better. The sun had a glare. But anyway, I am wearing these glasses today and they are disgusting. And I'm ready. I think I'm going to go in here and try to grab a piece of bacon or sausage. I'm lying. I'm not going to wear those. I'm going to wear these today because the blue go with my blue jean. Blue go with my blue jean. I'm going to go ahead and grab me a piece of sausage or a slice of bacon before I head out so I can take my blood pressure medicine. Yeah. I'll do a few clipping of the uh, drive-by therapy because I don't want to violate anyone. And then... I only have one client that I'm going to color her hair. I may not show you that. But I will show you um, as we decorate today, okay? Okay. She ready. What is this? Why we keep doing this? No. She ready. So, one. Hey y'all, hey, so I just left the drive-by therapy. I couldn't get you guys any um, footage because it was extremely heavy and we couldn't violate anyone's privacy as well. Uh, yeah, a lot of people are walking around with baggage that we do not have a clue. So be kind to people. And um, I say this again, it's okay to not be okay. Stop pretending like you're okay when you're not. Stop um, facing up to your hurt, your, your, your wrong, or your right. Uh, own up to your truth, uh, whether it's good, bad, or ugly. Uh, don't be blackmail material. Share. Tell your story so no one can cause you to be shamed or blackmail you with your past. Or try to hold anything over your head. Um, 
there is a lot of hurting people out there. I do believe that just because you're hurting does not mean you should hurt others. I get this thing, hurt people, hurt people. I'm not saying it's, it's real. I just feel like it is foul to put some pain or or uh, hurt on someone when you didn't like when it was done to you. So um, get you some therapy, y'all. I have signed up. I told you guys that. I shared. I have signed up. And after I have my first session, I will talk to you guys about it. But um, uh, we know it used to be uh, taboo for people of color to get um, therapy or seek some form of counselor. All we supposed to do is pray about it. Uh, 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 uh. It is 2024, and you do not have to carry that luggage. You do not have to stay stuck. Uh, when you live next to the hood, there's always something going on. Look at here. Look at this. And you know, we as black people, we watching. News people out here too, we is watching, honey. I hope somebody say, look at this one. He must want the police to get him because he keep running back and forth like he want to, you know. Baby shower outside and it's doing what? Raining. I can't get out and decorate in the rain, honey, because I cannot get sick. Uh, hey well my day is over um, I went to therapy I talked about that already I didn't get a chance to do my client so I had to reschedule it and I'm gonna do something that I hate to do is work on Sundays because I'm a woman of my word because I change my appointment I had to cancel her I let her reschedule and she wanted to come tomorrow morning which is Sunday at 8 30 so I have to go do her before I go to church now um, I'm just getting back shower for um, helping my friend decorate for uh, for the baby shower it was her vision y'all um, nevertheless I am NOT a pro balloon arch um garland 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 pro balloon nothing but nevertheless i always try to help that's why i don't hire myself out i just do um i just do my own events because i'm okay with whatever i do i do my sisters and those people but i don't do people that be trying to you know be looking at these arch and be like i want that one or no, I don't fancy it, but nevertheless, I did the best that I could with what I had with 
the 13,000 colors that she wanted. Nevertheless, um, that's a check done. Uh, so I didn't get a chance to color my hair. Hopefully by the next vlog I will. And I'm going to bring you guys some new something, some form of new product, some new items, something. I'm going to bring you that. I know we're moving into fall. So we'll try to do a little something with that. I'm in Fort Lauderdale, so winter, spring, summer, and fall is all the same for us. But nevertheless, every now and then, we get a little cool air. By the time 12 o'clock get here, honey, we snatching off anything that got to do with fall. Okay, fall or winter, honey. That 12 o'clock sun kicks our butt. But nevertheless, some of you guys are in different areas where you do get cold weather. So I'll show you something. Probably from Target, y'all, because you know I love Target. I'm try, I'm try H and M. I never, I haven't been there yet. I keep talking about it. I'm gonna go there. Not never, I just haven't been since I started vlogging. Haven't been back to Zara in a while. Um, haven't bought a new fragrance either, and I'm gonna do that as well. Now look, it ain't gonna be that three, four, five, hundred dollar fragrance, but it's gonna be something nice, and um, something that lasts. It's I have a fragrance in mind that I wanted to try. I've tried it rather. I've had um, samples and traveling size, and I really like it. And um, it lasts. And so I sprayed it on one time, like after I showered, sprayed it on. Woke up that morning, and it was still there. So I'm going to share that with you guys. And that's about it, y'all. I'm going to close this vlog. I hope you enjoyed the lunching with my sisters. And uh, y'all, I don't mean to be um, down and. Uh, black business but black businesses but I do believe sometimes because we are a black business owner and we are black um, patrons that we feel like as black owners we can give you anything because you're going to be proud that we're trying but sometimes I believe that we give the bare minimum I'm not saying this is the case as far as um, that restaurant because that was my first time there. I'm just saying that, you know, sometime it happens. So uh, if I came off hard with them, I apologize. I will give them another try and hopefully they have some flour and some eggs. And um, yeah, and I hope I get Ashley again. That is about it. Um, uh, yeah, I'm going to cut this right now. Um, Trying to continue to run this race without getting weary. Trying to continue to hold my head up high. Yeah. I'm out, y'all. That's it. That's all I got for y'all. I love you. And, um, yeah. Stay tuned for the next vlog. And everything you do, always be true to you. I love you in a minute.